energy i'm going to try and say the word moist as many times as i can and just see how long it takes it to catch on here we go oh you ready you ready it's gonna be a moisty round here great outfit great outfit going through the stage at the moment while well, only wear the same color oh my god i love if that it's black vibe. it's black if it's, if it's blue, blue, it's blue. It's blue. You look great. Got it, honey. Got it. So do you, oh, and we match the vape to the jumper now. Good. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. Haven't seen you. I know. All week. Oh, a bit freezy. A bit Tell me cold. everything. Oh my gosh, about what? I think I'm giving up TikTok. What? <laughs> well, that's fucking great. Yes! I have a relationship with TikTok I've decided like I do with dairy like sometimes I'm just a bit intolerant mm -hmm. to it I just Why? can't get over how fit the girls are oh I see I oh, see so you're not giving it up like to post no you're right I might stop myself from scrolling no, through what all the you need hotties. To do, no, what you need to do is change your algorithm. Like, get in a hole of, like, food videos. Okay, And then fine. all you'll get is food videos. Okay, good. Yeah, yeah. no, that's what I need. Yeah. yeah. Okay, where do you know the it? way? No. Do I? I'd like a cheese and ham toasty. Okay, let's go. Sorry about these. That's so <laughs> embarrassing, isn't it? God. God, that it really is. I know. Oh, I've lost many things in you my time. You look so nice. Really? The surprise. <laughs> 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 Shit. Yeah. Do you know I had that once, right? So we used to work at a spin studio, as you well. Really? No. no you. Yeah. Oh, and so obviously not, not like it's like one of the only parts of your fucking personality. Like oh my god, I used to work at a spin studio. <gasps> not even because I was fucking front of house and not even like the cool instructor. Anyway, once we had a Christmas party or something and I, you know, like put a bit of lippy on a bit of mascara and everyone was honestly like <laughs> you know, the shock. No. And I wore like a normal outfit, I had jeans on and they were like Oh my god, you look amazing. I was like, insult in that babe, is unreal. Like, you do set the bar low, me too. Of course. Like, when like, you set the bar why would you not? low, right? Yeah, sure. Start, but god, there's so I many. I have like a moist oh, goodness, go latte. On. Like really moist. It's got to be extra moist. What does that mean? Like extra moist. That doesn't mean anything. That doesn't look like a drive-in. No, no, it? it's the one, this one. It's by McDonald's, isn't it? Does it say drive-in? What the fuck is this? Oh, dear. Why are you using me. Apple Maps? Oh, okay. my God. No, listen what? to this. I went to the pub last night. You went to the pub? Yeah, twice. Yeah. Had, Friday and Saturday night, I've done something, and I just thought... It's and too like, much. And then everyone asked the same questions, and I thought, fuck, if this is what going to the pub is like, imagine fuck if you had to, pub, to date. Honestly. I know. Like, how many times do you have to repeat the same fucking thing? I almost want to go in with, like, a post-it note stuck to my head. Like, I'm Don't fine. Yeah. This is what's happening yeah, in my life. Like, good. I'm still with my boyfriend. Like, just sure. stop talking to me. Honestly, the amount of times my boyfriend gets away with shit because I just can't be asked to date. Right. I just think, oh, fair one. My friend's on Raya. Fun. You know the one, the celeb They've one? I've got a lot of friends on Raya, actually. Oh, really? Have you got loads of celeb friends? I've just got to know because they let any old fucking riffraff in nowadays. Yeah, I know. But also, Raya mm. doesn't have, like... It's got a footballers on there. Ugh. Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Raya doesn't have, like, um location. So you could match with someone in fucking Italy and you think, well, yeah, that's, that's true. fucking yeah, it is moist. waste that is of moist. time. Yeah. Moist? Why are you obsessed with moisture? <laughs> Getting dry anywhere. Why are your feet <laughs> so big? What the Stop. fuck? Stop! The socks as well. The stripy no, socks. No, don't, because them. I got these. Oh, in. they're even the they're same blue. colour. They're so cute. Yeah. I'm blue. Wait, I, can't find... I can't find it. Die, I would die, I would die. Oh, don't you dare me. download the Google Maps app no, on my no, phone. No, no, no. I just need to find the. I'm watching Couples Therapy on BBC. Have you seen it? Oh. Sorry, You're it says die. navigate. What do I do? No, don't do that. Yeah. BBC iPlayer couples therapy, so fucking good. It's real couples in therapy with oh, this I've, epic I've therapist. Heard about this. this one woman is like super fiery, really defensive. Like, I just call bullshit. They're kind of like constantly oh. like just pulling each other up on things. And I think James and I are very like that because we're just both so confrontational. Really? Yeah, for sure. I love it. I love a fight. <laughs> So you've been to the pub loads? You're yeah, so wild. I've been, I, so on Friday night, Roy had some friends around to his house for, for drinks. Do you know what I his think house, actually? Your house. No, they're his parents' house. Oh, fine. Do you know what I think? Hosting is actually not very fun. It's like fucking Ooh, stressful. I kind of enjoy it. Yeah, of course you do. Of course <laughs> you fucking do. I hate going and having to be like a guest. No. I'm worse than being a guest. That's the worst, is when you host, you can't fucking leave. We were <laughs> awake until four in the morning. No! Yes! No, and people, you hosting? 
people would not leave and I was What like, were you hosting? What like, kind of night? Drink, just a drinks party and I, that's what I mean though and I said to him A party at 4 a.m.? We need to have a cut off time. Oh we haven't done this. that for years. Oh, that's a lot. It's isn't a lot, it? it's a lot, it's a lot. And also by then I've got nothing else. Nothing, nothing to, to say. say. There should be parties where you just go to and everyone has to bring a whiteboard and it's like, <laughs> here are the headlines on my life. I'm sure. single. Yeah. Broke up with my girlfriend with my girlfriend, boyfriend, whatever. Yeah. Didn't get a promotion last promotion. Yeah. Whatever. Like yeah. I don't yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean. Yeah. Then we can All actually the basics. Have, oh whatever. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, Wait. no problem just fucking cross the road when it's a green light. It's actually their right of way, I hate to say it. I don't think so. Oh look at those cute children. Are they? Interesting. <laughs> 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 anyway, there was this girl last night, and I was like, "Oh my god, how's your boyfriend?" And she's like, "I broke up with him six months ago." And I was like, "Well, that wasn't on Instagram. You didn't give I know me the headlines. <laughs> How I did it? Know? I know everything. You, oh my god, I had that thing. Oh, I had that thing when I was like, "How was your holiday?" And they were like, "How did you know I went on holiday?" I'm like, uh, Instagram, because I follow you. Yeah, and I'm like, in isn't the that the hole. point though? Yeah, I guess so. Why would people think you wouldn't know that? <laughs> the other day, someone was like, "Bye, see you on Instagram," and I was like, "See you on Instagram." That's, That's good. The way. Yeah, That's that the is way. the way. Tell me about your surprise. Surprise. Oh, it was I so it was, nice. Was be, I really thought it would be like. I told Jay that something. you said that, and he was like, lol, she's so silly. Well, no. not really. He was like, what are we going to do? How are we going to do that in the dark in London? <laughs> and I was true, like, true. Where would we land? Who knows? Buckingham Palace roof? Who knows? Who knows? I, I don't have the techers for that. Al? I've, I've done it. You've landed on. No, I've skydived. Oh, yeah, but in like to a mass, like, part oh, of on a beach. Oh, beach? Yeah. Come on, girl. How was the skydive? It was honestly like the most amazing, like co couldn't recommend it enough. It's the most adrenaline you will ever feel in your life. Yeah. Do you think adrenaline is quite hard to come by these days? Yes, unless I'm doing like, I don't know, like the other night when I did that gig, I did think that was adrenaline oh, yeah, in fine. my body. Yeah. But otherwise, no. Or if I'm walking home and someone walks a bit close to me, I get a spike of adrenaline. I think, is this the moment <laughs> I finally get mugged? <laughs> I'm kidnapped. Is this it? It's Probably, never it. It's never it. It's like a crazy guy. No that might one say. would fucking mug you. <laughs> Someone said to me when I was walking home last night. He was like walking towards me, looking a bit menacing, and then he just went, "I'm sorry, I'm just going for a piss." <laughs> and I was like, "No worries, mate. Couldn't care less." So we went to the Royal Albert Hall and we watched Cirque du Soleil. Fuck, Fuck me. Those people—they're not human. What are they? They're like—they fucking must come from a different the, planet. The contortionist. That makes me feel like. No, and there were four of them, and they were all like four contortionists balancing on top of each other. It was fucking mental. No, it was mental. Oh, I only got one. Fuck. I honestly think they must have their ribs removed or something. No, I think they're just super bendy. I honestly think you could do that. No, no way. Yeah. No way. Their parents put them on a fucking stretcher at birth. I'm telling you, <laughs> it's not. Po it's not possible. I think it is. <laughs> no. I think if you stretched enough, dislocated enough bones, you'd yeah, just you have be to dislocate surely. repeatedly. Yeah, I just think, oh, bravo, <laughs> bra fucking vo. Bravo. I was stood up in my fucking box, feeling royal like this. Did you sit in a box? Yeah, we sat in a box. Just the two of you? No, no, no. Did you eat food? Yeah, a pizza and champagne. It was hilarious. I was like, God, who was am the, I? Was the champagne moist? Uh, stop. <laughs> was it moist? I don't know what that means. No, champagne's normally dry. What's your real name? Guess. I can't believe you don't know that. Oh I don't God. know that because my mum just asked. If you say Alison, I will fuck you. <laughs> no, when I said to mum, I don't think it's Alice. No. It's not, I didn't even think of Alison. Good. I'm guessing it's like Alexandra. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to know my full, full name? It's Alexandra India Shoihan Macintosh. Shoihan is good. Shoihan means forceful mountain in Chinese. Very true. Right? You are a forceful mountain. But it doesn't mountain. fit on the landing forms, my full name, and it's really fucking annoying. Really annoying. Oh, I think you've got to drop Macintosh and go for Shoi Han. Someone else said that to me. I feel very Asian when I say Shoi Han. I am very Asian. Don't know if you knew. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen all this Haley and Selena stuff? Yeah, can we talk about I've this? I've got to talk because about it. I'm, I'm like, like half clued up, but then I tried to tell Holly the story today and I knew nothing. Me too! <laughs> I was like, Ray, no, I don't know. Okay, all I really know TikTok. is Selena is now like the most followed person on Instagram. Yeah. Because it's Kylie, Kendall, Haley being mean girls. Is that right? Yeah. Bad vibes. Bad vibes. I said to Raw, I was like, oh my god, have you seen all this stuff about Hayley and Justin Bieber? And he was like, no. I thought Hayley Bieber was Justin's sister. I was <laughs> like, are you fucking with me? Wasted. Honestly, it's fucking, this shit is wasted on you. I kind of dig that from him. But they're just being mean girls. <laughs> and they like made fun of her eyebrows. I don't really know what the fuck's going on with the eyebrows. Oh yeah, okay, so it was something like she'd over laminated her eyebrows and then the girls were like, I'm not saying it's perfect. Yeah. I'm yeah. saying the God's timing is 
is always right. And I will always and forever be team fucking Selena. Me too, like, me too. why are you being me? Were you a bitch at school? I was literally about to ask you the same thing. Look, at the time. <laughs> look, to all my fucking survivors I <laughs> that were in school with me. I at think, the time, I was going through a lot. Okay? I think. I think I wasn't the nicest. Sure. I think people find me intimidating. Yeah, because you're a forceful mountain. Right. Precisely. Yeah. I think people probably find you intimidating too. Although you're a bit less more so like, now. I think yeah. back in the day maybe, but not so anymore. But I'm I, pretty fucking soft. But I think for that reason, edges. sometimes what I say or do can be construed as mean. Mm. But actually, I'm just not giving a fuck. Yes. But that comes out mean. It can come out mean. And I do get that. Not like I never experienced that with you, but I can. I know that people that don't give a fuck and are just like this is me it comes across Precisely. as intimidating and sometimes Precisely. mean. Precisely. What do you mean or were people mean to you? I know for a fact that I engaged in bullying behaviour but because it was like doggy dog yeah, at my school yeah. like we had such a bitchy group of girls like one day you were in you were top of the food chain you were yes. being a cow next day you were bottom and you were getting all of the behaviour that you'd yeah. been putting onto others. So it was kind of good character building to be honest like yeah I was a bitch but so was so were people to me do you know oh. what i mean like we were all just kind of fucking horrible and if i could go back and sit us all down and be like girls just fyi this like fighting each other yeah. is really bad vibes it and you're gonna grow vibes. out of it so quickly and you're gonna wish that that just that is a horrible little maneuver you've got Apparently to do there to go down here are you fucking with me get out oh that's so stressful get should out. i go excuse me Get thank up. you so much. Oh, lots of oh, love. Thank you. Us. No, they, they love it. They love it. Oh my god! Don't need the delivery driver. Oh my god! Don't Ooh, hit the van. Me. Oh my god! It's this awful. is awful. Horrible. Well maneuvered. This is not a drive-through, by the way. God's but timing is always right. But I have also been on the receiving end. Big, big. Yeah, big that's big the time. thing. I think. I think big there's just this time. thing of like survival of the fittest, like showing off to boys, like putting people down to make yourself feel yes. good, like all of that stuff that is just like growing up. Jesus, I don't know why we were all so mean. It's not looking good, is it? Where are we going? Where are we going? What are we doing? Is there? I need my moist latte. Ugh, I wish you'd stop saying that. It's making me feel sick. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even see Starbucks. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? I don't know where we are. I really, really, I really, I really, I really got to stop. I was also at uni. In oh, the did you not grow out of it by uni? No, no, I was the subject. Oh no. Yeah, and I at the, the time. The mean girl behaviour. Fuck me, mean, toxic, no. nasty bitches. No, yes. no, no. Yes. At uni. Yeah. Fucking. No, I that's no so bad. Because I literally. But when you're in it, that's what you. What's what? You're absolutely right. You're just surviving. Like you don't register it. Mm. But now I'm like, fuck. They were really mean. That's really horrible. They were really mean. Also, have you seen that filter that everyone's using? Yeah, the bold glamour. I look horrific. Do you? I look like Prince Charming from Shrek. <laughs> it's just my like strong features I think oh. Strong features, that's a good way of saying I have got strong features, I've got like a really big chin and jaw Got a like quite strong a like features. prominent nose That's what your mum's friends say to your mum when they're like trying to say oh, something like She's got such strong features yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a new bit of lingo out on the street No Yeen 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 You don't even know Yeen. Oh you know sorry, you don't even, to be yeen no you know, you you know. You know where Starbucks is. Horrible. Hi. Really bad. Yin. Yin. It's not even a nice thing to say. Yin. yin no. I kind of respect the efficiency of it. Of no. yin. Of yin. Like, just put all the words together. Why not? Oof. Do you know what I mean? No. Do you know what a yin? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake. Do you know what a yin? Do you know what a yin? Ayin. That is moist. That word is moist. You've got to stop saying moist. Isn't it so bad when you pick up a word and you can't stop saying it? Yeah. Do you go to Goldsmiths? Yeah. I completely forgot that. Yeah, I'm kind of asking. That's kind of cool. Like, <laughs> cool people, well, not you, but cool people do go to Goldsmiths. Was that really, like, did you feel not cool? No, I felt honestly I cooler felt than anyone. fucking anyone. cool. Define cool. Because I would argue cool is, like, being a bit different. So, no, Goldsmiths, what am I? Yes, yeah, so, I mean, you did think you were cool. This is not looking good for you, babe. But Your latte is just far, far away. My moist latte. <laughs> see, she thinks she's cool. Where? That girl at the bus stop. Oh, I can't see your big head's in the way. She is kind of cool. Looks like Ruby. Ruby! Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't her. You know those fucking, um, what are those big shoes? 
buffaloes. One girl I did know had a hairline fracture from wearing her buffaloes. Yeah, she had to fully go on fucking crutches. Listen, I'm into it. Like, grow your armpit hair out, shave your head. Like, whatever. You do you. Like, whatever makes you feel good, get it done. Right. But also, don't pretend to be, like, Something grungy. that you're not. Yeah. And that's why I had a Bristol. That's why I hated Bristol, because I was so... Oh, yeah. Also, wait, not. Bristol's so, like, druggy, isn't Br it? Bristol Uni was quite If intense. you don't take care you're honestly not even worth talking to yeah like, that's why you were really yeah that's so sad it's so sad i bet they're all really into fucking yoga and qigong now anyway do so you think yeah no, no. where is the drive through section it's not a drive through it says on google drive through i'm gonna cry you all can't... i fucking wanted is a drive through well, you can pull over don't panic oh, yeah, run out. that's so true god are you okay <laughs> god for you if you were a dog yeah what dog would you be I like, don't know dogs very well. I think you'd be like one of those yappy border terriers that everyone hates. Big... That everyone hates. Notoriously, like, as a person, I'm quite likeable. That's true. Like, I think most that's people true. that first meet me, at least. True. So, I but don't think that's true. <laughs> no, maybe you'd be like a cocker spaniel. No, way too over-enthusiastic. Have you met You're yourself? more like a cocker. No, I'm like an Afghan hound. Right, what do you want? You want me to go up to the lady and say, can I have a moist latte? No, can I just have a... Okay, listen, carefully. Yeah. Oh, God, no. Okay. A skinny frap, low no. white, iced I mocha want... chop. I want an oat latte, whipped cream, regular, not the vegan whipped cream. Oat latte with regular whipped cream oat latte with regular you have whipped cream medium on your medium size no judgment but that is wild and i need a cookie straw and a real straw i'll text you sure <laughs> wish me luck bye juicy google fully lied to you what a fucking snake yeah that's annoying isn't it wow okay well we've got to find a drive through here you go thanks babe thank you so um, much here you go two thank straws thank you so much very good no coffee for you no i've had two today I just want this tasty. Oh. I've been thinking about it all morning. God, just another reason why you can't um, trust anyone. Yeah, anyone. Would you do couples therapy with Rob? Oh my God. Funny you should say that. Because now I've been thinking about couples therapy, obviously watching this. Oh, it's so cheesy. Tell me, why do you want to have couples therapy? I just think it'd be game changing. I, like, I don't think it'd be problems. I, I just think you need to be like agree. a normal human being. But I've never even had therapy. I think unless you feel like there's stuff that you haven't worked through like is there anything from your childhood or whatever that you feel like really has negative like do you feel there are things that you've never really dealt with i think that's well, see like no that's pretty amazing I mean, it's just something about your upbringing that you had a very happy upbringing i did in general i think there's things like don't get me wrong i can see like things from my younger self that like impact me in my life now if that makes sense like, give me an example like constantly wanting like external validation because when i was a kid my parents both worked really hard and i was often needed to be looked after by someone else constantly because they were working okay i don't think that's a sad thing i think for them okay. that's amazing and i think i just like dealt with it but i know that then i was like a performer and i was constantly like looking for attention seeking attention and approval because of that i Thing. Okay. I don't think that's a sad thing. I don't think even... that's something to work through. Like that's no. just who you are. Mm, exactly. And that's cool. Yeah. No, I don't think I have anything to work through. Oh my god. <laughs> like when people ask me where I grow up, grew up, it's like actually that's quite a hard question to answer. Really? Yeah, because like I literally spent six months of my year every single year until I went to boarding school in Malaysia. Really? Yeah. We would always leave prep school the day before the last day of term because the flight was so cheap. What is prep school? Prep Explain school. to the muggles. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> but I actually, at one point in my life, when I was two weeks old, was Singapore Airlines' youngest ever passenger. My mum literally gave birth to me and got on a plane. No! Like, a lot of my identity, especially, like, my femininity, is, like, my family is full of, like, powerful, feisty women. Mm. And that's so not English. So do you feel, like, when you're in Malaysia, do yeah. you feel quite English? And then when you're here, exactly. you feel quite exactly. Asian. Exactly. And it's like you feel like you're yeah. always square peg round hole. Yeah. Which I actually quite like. Like, don't get me wrong, I would never have changed it for the world. It's also, that explains so much. Like, even what you're saying about, like, you know, people find you intimidating. Like, yeah. yes. that's just you being... Right. That's just how you would be. Like, about my family. Exactly. Because we're all like that. Yeah. So, it's so like, no one's intimidated. Yeah. yeah. And I don't get intimidated very easily because mm. I grew up with the most intimidating mm. women ever. Mm -hmm. So I don't find, like, when people are like, oh, but how do you find the confidence to do that? I'm like, I don't even have... Not in an arrogant way, but I've never had to think about that. That's been my normal. Yeah. Ever. Yeah. You know what I mean? Lots of things don't get to mm. you. Even though you are an emotional person. I know. Fascinating. So weird. Some things stick. 
some things like what would say what would someone say etched on my heart like if someone said something about the fact that you used to be fat would that bother you oh uh, yeah i think that would still that would me. still stick you okay or like if they thought that now i'm mean, like no one fucking would, joking no one, would ever, so hard. no one would ever think that i do did um, you get bullied about that mm. being fat mm -hmm. really like how give me an example just like boys being horrible oh like the whale oh yeah calling me a whale Maybe oh like, that was Use the whale now, bitches! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, mustn't litter. Put it in my shoe. <clears throat> Ali gets very cross when you litter in her car. Is it moist enough, babe? Yeah, it's moist. It's extra moist. Thank god for that. You know that was a prank? I was like, I'm gonna see how many times oh, I can no! say no! I'd be like, how <laughs> soon does she realise? Fucking minute one, you got it. Minute one, me being like, what's this new word? You were like, why are you saying moist all the time? And I was like, no! <laughs> that is so good! Yeah, I was like, I'm just oh, so clever! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really fun. Oh, yay! I'm so good at this game. Look, look how they spelt my name. God love her. She was having a really horrible time. Actually. You know, this is... A, okay, listen. This... She spelt Georgie. I've, I've, this is a TikTok uh, conspiracy theory. Mm. Uh, Starbucks's free press is the fact that they always spell people's name wrong. So people take a picture and upload it, and then Starbucks is getting free press every time they do that. Very so they good. Literally, they literally tell that, well, this is all the theory, but they're telling their staff to write the name wrong so that every time they're like, oh my god, lol, look how Starbucks spelt my name. Free press, millions of times a day. That's really clever. clever. Do you ever get heartburn? No. Oh my god. I take heartburn medication. But I've got a disease. Sorry. You take heartburn medication, but you never get heartburn. Because, make it make sense. Because I, well, because I take the medication, I don't get heartburn. If I didn't take the medication, I'd f fucking sure get heartburn. Would you? Yeah, I've got, I've got very severe IBS. This is a safe space for girls with IBS. I have got every True. fucking stomach issue on the planet. You mm. name it, I've got it. I've had fucking. I've had barium up my ass. I've had to shit under observation. Shit under observation? Yeah, babe. That's traumatic. Go to therapy for that. <laughs> You're fucking joking. Okay, listen to this. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> when I was like, shit under observation. when I was like in my teenage years, like I once didn't shit for three weeks. That is not an exaggeration. Three weeks, and I honestly was nine months pregnant. This is why I believe in naturopathy. Na naturopathy? Na no idea. Naturopathy. The one. Say it again. Herbal shit. Naturopathy. Naturopathy. Whatever. The one. Herbology. Yeah, basically. <laughs> I then went. I. I honestly was on every like the strongest prescribed laxative that you can get. And you couldn't shit. I couldn't shit. I literally could not get rid of it. Anyway, so then I had to um, go and see this uh, la, 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 neurologist. No, like la la. I know, that's your brain, isn't it? Like she, you know, she, shaman. She, she basically she touches you and then you. You reiki healer. Basically, she touched me and I, she I took, took a shit. Fuck off. Swear on my life. Fuck off. Sat there for an hour. She held my head and I then did a shit after three weeks of like every medication. You did a shit there, then, and then were you on the toilet with yeah, her? Yeah, no, I was out on the bed and I shat myself. No, no of course you I didn't. But <laughs> well, you did it that night. Yeah, I did it that night. What did she do? To I you? think now. No, but I don't. I'm, this is what I mean. There are people with magic powers in the world. Oh, I don't not believe it. I believe it. What? <laughs> <laughs> I've had everything. Honestly, I could tell you fucking shit stories until you fall asleep. I won't be falling asleep. That's why I'm gluten free. Right. You know? Not like hardcore. If someone like made a small bellini and was like small thing, I would eat that. A fucking bellini, honestly. We should just count how many times you sound posh in a day. Because that was good. <laughs> you opted for bellini. Well, well, I was vegan for five years, so what do you want? I wasn't, that's a lie. I was vegan for two years. If I was you fucking for say I was vegan for two years. I was vegan for two years. Well, and it did not sit well with me, I'll tell you that for free. How do we go home? I'm going to get it up for you. Just picking a fun got loads of texts to reply to trying to get my boyfriend to therapy <laughs> fucking full-time job that is are you gonna go i hope so i can't afford it so no please but... go well he can what did you do it no i bet he wouldn't i'd put money on him going no, we don't need to go to fucking therapy but that's, and I'd be the like, that's exactly problem. why we that's do that's the whole problem that's right there mate is why we do need that to is the whole to fucking therapy. problem thanks thanks cack <laughs> looks like a cack too. <gasps> oh my god! I have to tell Can you. Can you not do that when we're in a movie vehicle? <gasps> I've got like cookie in my bum. Why is it? How so did you manage that? Those jeans and I thought like, they. Oh my Jesus Christ! Can you stay on your side of the room. Thanks. Sorry. Shit. The bed. Okay. Oh my god, why did I not leave this? This house here? is huge. huge. Where are we? I don't know, but I want to live here, baby. Sorry, what did you just have an orgasm about? Sorry, this is fucking mega. Right, I was in the pub last night. Don't know if you know. <laughs> <laughs> last, last, last. Yeah. She's had a big weekend. And um, we were inside, 
and this guy is just like not like elbowing my friend. Goodness. Anyway, my friend was like, mate, sorry, but like what you did, like what? And you're elbowing. Like, you're in my way. Yeah. Fight. No. Brawl. Like lads. Two lads. Two lads. My what friend. Is it with boys? My best mate drinks everywhere fighting's bad vibes i actually rate boys that go to mma because i just think you've noticed you're doing you've something got about this it. primal right. like thing inside you that you need to deal with and so you're you're yeah you're channeling it like in a positive way Goodbye. there's your adrenaline babe yeah get to the pub on a saturday night right and we were in fulham can you believe it, do you know i've been assaulted <laughs> what? Yeah. Tell the story. Oh my god, I was on a night out. Oh, actually, so have I. Have Sorry. I not told you this? Story? No, but I have to continue. What do you mean? I have been assaulted too. Oh my god. <laughs> Go on. Assault is common. Common uh, assault. Mine was actual sexual assault <gasps> because. Babe. Yeah. Well, god, no, that took. It wasn't that took a doctor. Basically, I was outside a club and my friend like bumped into this guy by accident he then started like gobbing off calling her really horrible things i oh, billy big bollocks i actually think i i think i embody like the energy of a six foot four geezer like okay i walk home as if no one's gonna touch me like i think i'm huge and i could fight anyone okay. i can't i started like gobbing off being like mate mm, sit down what are you talking about he then got right up in my face and was like oh you've got big balls put his hand up my skirt yeah touch my nun which not good <laughs> Vibes, Shut up. Obviously. Wait, where, so where, where, where were you? Cheltenham. I pushed him away. Oh, the shock of it touching my nunny. I was oh, shocked. That is not obviously. Cool. So pushed him away. He then came back and just fucking decked me. I fell to the floor. Are you serious? <laughs> Passed out for like two seconds. Yeah. He fully decked me. Black eye, bleeding nose, like really bad. Luckily, the police were like just like roaming the streets, saw him, found him, caught him. Uh, it actually all went to court. He technically still owns me 700 quid. So, well, you better cash in on that. Nah, me. the bailiffs are after him, but um, it's not looking good for me. I can't believe that. I know, it was bad, yeah. Did you feel like sh that's quite traumatic? I At the time, it felt a tiny bit traumatic. I think I just kind of loved the attention, to be honest, afterwards. I just felt every night like, everyone felt everyone's so like, sorry oh my for God, me. Everyone was texting me. Yeah. <laughs> my ex boyfriend, who had dumped me in cold blood, rang me, and I thought, that's when you know. Ain't that the fucking truth? You miss that's me, when do you? You, know. you worry about me, do you? And my black eye. Did you have a black eye? Yeah. <gasps> wow. Where were you assaulted? In Brixton. No! I was wasted, so I was like, kind of whatever. You're oh, a lightweight. Babe, I'm the biggest lightweight on the Yeah, planet. no, me too. I hate wine. I just think wine is just shit. I really hate wine. I find that shocking. What do you mean? I hate it, I just think it's disgusting. What do you drink, Cardi Breather? No, Vog Soda Lime, White Claws. A White Claw is so long, honestly. <laughs> I love them. That is so bad. Why? Because they taste like shite. I think that people pretend to like wine so that they think... People pretend to like white claws so no. they don't take the calories. No. Babe, there's no other reason for a hard seltzer. I think it's delicious. Than just like tracking your macros. It tastes like flavoured juice. It doesn't. Wine is disgusting. It tastes like Good wine sewer is not disgusting. water. It tastes like acidic sewer water. I think you've got bad choice in wine. And, and it also makes me have a blocked nose. And I just think, <laughs> oh, I just... And also, I get that thing. Then I was like, I've got fucking gout. Last time I had a glass of wine, my joints started hurting. Couldn't <laughs> fall asleep because my joints, my wrists... That must have been a heavy Pinot Noir Could because not that's move. not normal. It's disgusting. I'm sorry. I think wine is honestly the Satan's drink. I think you're to... actually unwell. I, I, I think it's really nuts. you should reassess the, the friendship. Sarge is going out for a glass of wine and she's coming back mortal. Wine is a fucking memory eraser. Like, what is fun about that? It's fucked. It is fucked. So delicious. People who drink. Why wine... are you so passionate? I just think it's fucked. <laughs> I just. Why are people not drinking white claws? Mm, because they're minging. They're not. They're horrible. They're not. But I just think it's a skinny girl, like, gym bunny thing to drink, and I think it's boring. Skinny girl. <laughs> I don't know anyone who talks about the gym more than you do. I actually even look. I bought this fucking grenade bar. Well done, like, babe. If you're going to do that, why don't you fucking drink a white claw? Do you know what I mean? Why are you fucking downing the Pinot White? Because I like it. Sauvignon Blanc. Motherfucker. You might as well drink. I don't really like white wine, to be fair, but I do love a good red. You might as well drink battery acid. I'll smash a whispering angel. Oh, okay, fine. That one I can get. And a bit of fizz. One glass. Fizz. Gross. Makes you fart. Non-stop. Makes you burp. Non-stop. Oh, What's fun about that? Oh. White claws also. Uh, no. Is it still? No, it's. <laughs> no, it's 
No, it's fucked. God forbid it's still. No. I wish Just so hard that I didn't like the taste of it. I'm a gulper. Hey. I think it's delicious. A good glass of wine. Oh my God, I dream about it. No. Honestly, my dream night is just to be alone in silence, drinking a really good Malbec and eating a whole share bag of Maltesers. That would be like my death row meal, actually, now I come to think of it. I think it's fascinating that some people love the taste of alcohol and I fucking despise it. Yeah, I'm but really... it's a bit like coffee or olives or like anything a bit like that's an acquired taste. But everyone drinks alcohol. People think I'm really weird, actually. This is something that I have been thinking about. Like, why? Well, you're a bit like cooler now because I think it's way less cool to get like mortar. Or like sure. more like socially acceptable to be what do they call it? Sober curious. What the fuck is that? I know. It's like you're not sober, but you're sober curious. I think it's like more acceptable to say, oh no, I'm not drinking tonight, and for someone to be like, what, why? You were pregnant or are you an alcoholic? Which but one why is do you have to ask me why? I know, why? it is why? frustrating. Why? Why can I not just say I'm not drinking? I know. And that just be enough? Babe, I think you should be able to say that. Right. Well, also, this is a big Western Asian difference. I would have thought my mum had had a stroke if we sat down and she was like, do you want to drink? Doesn't happen. Never. Really? In, in my, I've never, ever sat down at home with my parents. Ever. Like, it's just... That is so not normal. Because drinking, like, that's not really a part of the culture. Yeah, because in, 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 well, first of all, because Asians are such lightweights, because they're actually allergic Tiny. to it. <laughs> Asians literally can't drink. Like, you would go out to drink, but you would never sit at home and, and drink. It just wouldn't happen. Go to it's someone's quite house. good, isn't it? Because yeah. when you think about, like, alcohol now, and like, they make, speak about it all the time, like, that would actually just be an illegal drug. Like, yeah. if you discovered it now. Yeah. Like, shit. Well, like, would you sit down with your parents and have a glass of wine? Yes. No, like, yeah, when you like, were, like, younger? Yes. Well, my parents both work in the pub trade, number one, so I actually oh, grew up in pub, okay, okay, pubs. Fine. Yeah, I did grow up in girl. pubs, yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What I'm just thinking that? about it. I'm like, well, my dad's, like, borderline alcoholic, like, has been to AA, didn't enjoy it. He was so funny. Dad's been to AA? Of course. And then he said, I just didn't like that guy that kept ringing me. I was like, what, your sponsor? Who's trying to help you? <laughs> Are you mad? He's a functioning alcoholic, basically. For real? Yeah, for sure. Like, talk he would say the same. Uh, every night. Oh, yes. Like, there's a lot of willpower involved with my dad not drinking. And he'll be on the wagon for, like, how X amount of time. And then he'll go, oh, just a tipple. And then he'll start drinking again. Borderline probably problematic, but because he's 80, you know, like, I don't know, who's that woman on EastEnders that smoked fags until oh, she was, like, 90? Butcher. It's like, because you're alive, no one really thinks it's problematic. If he was, like, 30, yeah, we might all be true. like, Jesus that Christ, you drink a lot. That is true. So, yeah, I've always grown up around booze. Like, my family is super boozy. That's why, then. That's yeah. why. That's why I like it. I'm like a fucking fish. It is changing, I think. Like, think even when we were, like, 16, it was super cool to, like, smash a litre of white lightning and be paralytic. What the fuck is white lightning? Oh, you're so posh! What is that? <laughs> you know you're going that way, don't you? I know. <laughs> Another thing that fucking makes me pissed off is people telling me how to drive. What's your boundary that you're going to say in that? I will not drive you anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> you or fucking what? But you know, <laughs> what is this? It's awful. How's this going to work? I know, it's just really bad. Like, what have be, you done that this for? This is going to be really bad. That makes me stressed. Oh, fuck. Are no, you all going that way? Can you move house? Because this is... <laughs> <gasps> She's just hit something. No, she hasn't. She just stalled. Do you know what? That toasty was exactly what I fucking needed. I feel great. I love I really dig this vibe. Congratulations. Have you seen all those girls in the little, like, quilted gilets? I think I need one of them. Yeah. Oh, my God. Very I was cool. literally looking for that last it's one. kind of like mummy chic, but I'm into it. Yeah, you are quite mummy chic. Okay, well. Love you. Love you. Bye. Love you. Bye. 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 Oh, I probably won't get out when all these people are here. Awkward. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> That's like when you're like, say goodbye to your auntie. Do you kiss? My mum on the lips? Yeah. No, do you? Yeah. On the lips? Yeah, on the lips. Mwah. Yeah. She'd kiss you on the lips too. No! Yeah, see you tomorrow, 7 a.m. Oh, 7 a.m. Fuck it, I'll don't get there at 6. <laughs> Nutter. Love you, thank Love you. Love you, bye. bye. bye.